Where do I even start this thing? I'm not a, I'm not a mechanic, engineer. I don't know rocket science. Boom. Sense, right? Yes, yeah, the only way that makes sense. It's like the poles in the way, no? Oh! It's pointing at those. That's the only thing that makes sense, right? M, J. That would be an I, if anything. So, these are the J's. I thought they were thicker, but they're not. Boom! Got it. Why are there only M and J in each thing? Okay. M and J. Y'all thought. Now this part. Let's carefully put that down. Q. An N and then the J. The same bolts. Let's put that N instead. Got it. Freaking back's killing me. Welcome back. We're getting somewhere. We're getting places. We're moving up in the world. Oh, God damn it. We're up to the the L bolts, the I bolts, the, or the I things. This goes through here, and this goes to the J. L I J. We'll go through there. Boom. Is that really what it says? Yeah, that's it. What? Uh, uh. Oh, you don't do anything. Oh, I think I figured it out. It's inside this. Boom. Then this. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> right? That's what it wants. That's what it's asking for. I don't need nobody's help. I don't need nobody's help, man. Shit. I do this shit alone. Damn, man, you need I can create, I can build. I'm a handyman. I like that. Oh, my back is killing me. It's the wrong one. Hey, what am I doing? It's pulling my body on my hands. Wait. <laughs> Boom. And y'all thought I couldn't do it. First thing you thought is like, yo, Luke's not gonna be able to put this together. Thought wrong, bitch. Almost there. Let's get up the. Just the cushions and the handles and the uh, end. Come on, hardest parts are done, man. Come on. I'm a true champion. The final product, the final form. So sick, man. So sick. Completely transformable. Flip a room like so. Slides in. Adjustable height. Dope. You can even recline this bitch. Even lower. Oh, ooh. You can even have proper posture. Or you could just be chilling out with the homies. Just like this. It's just like chilling. Just chilling. Yo, what's up, bro? What's going on? Yeah, that's what's up. Boom. 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 Yeah. Work it. Sponsored. JK. All right, just jumping right into this clip. Uh, yeah, let's just point out the elephant in the room. I, I, I'm 
okay, I get it. I haven't filmed or picked up the camera or done an update in quite a bit. Focused on me? It is. The truth is, is because I feel like um, I've showed you every single workout that I've continued to do throughout the last few weeks. I'm still not allowed or just not, not allowed. Or just, I'm just not ready yet for anything new, anything exciting. Uh, I can't do really any push. I, I, I've evolved a lot. I had to I have. I made a lot of progress. I can do rows. I could do some shoulder presses a little bit with light weight, you know, front raises, you know, light presses with uh, like maybe five, 10 pounds max with a short range of motion. Nothing, uh, nothing super exciting, at least in my opinion. I don't like to pick up the camera and show you guys guys, the same 10 workouts that I've been doing the past month and a half, because that's just the truth. That's just what it is. Um, so I haven't been motivated to pick up the camera, but here's the update. Uh, mobility is really good. I can, you know, full, looks pretty natural at this point. Same thing, pretty natural, almost there. Bicep flex, arm flex, arm, arm is looking full because arms are one of the few muscles that I can hit at the moment, really. Really emphasize on, ugh. So mobility is A1, physical therapy, my sessions are done. Uh, after the year, oh, why is it not focused on after the year ended, we didn't want to continue to go uh, because then you have to start, you have to repay for like how many ever sessions that I wanted or whatever, and it wasn't really worth it. Um, so I'm not going to physical therapy anymore. I'm kind of doing certain workouts at my house uh, here, mostly just shoulder exercises, like chest movement exercises, a lot of band work uh, with these, you know, making sure everything's up the par, I guess. So I'll be doing that. I'm not gonna film the boring stuff because you guys just watched a bunch of time lapses of me building a chair for shit, for crying out shit, bro. So I'll just show you, I'm probably gonna do a light, quick shoulder workout, um, light stuff. I just did squats yesterday with some upper body. Like I said, I could do so, I could do the workouts that I do like every day because it's nothing, it, it doesn't kill me. It really doesn't kill the body, you know? So I do a lot of the same workouts all the time. It's so repetitive. But my squat's getting up. My squat's getting up. Uh, 365 for a set of five beltless in vans. Like I said, no belt, high bar, shitty, shitty knee sleeves. I'm keeping it raw. So my strength with that's gonna go up. I'll film my next squat session uh, for sure, for sure. When I go heavy, when I go heavy. And that feels great. It's, it's, it's A-OK -okay because I let the weight rest on my traps. That's why I do high bar. So it works out perfectly. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna show you guys, run you guys through a quick shoulder workout, nothing crazy. Like I said, I can't be shoulder pressing 80 pounds, 80 pound, 100 pound dumbbells, 115s. Honestly, I hit in the summer, kind of crazy. Can't do any of that. But yeah, no, mobility, um, normal stuff like carrying that big ass box with the chair in it earlier, I can do that on my own now, man. We're making progress. But it's probably gonna be another few weeks, month until I can start probably pressing some lightweight, I'm guessing. Um, but we'll see, man. I'll keep you updated when it starts getting exciting. But right now, I'll show show you guys some of my shoulder workout, man. I don't want to keep you guys in the dark. I want to keep, you know, pumping out some of this, uh, la, 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 some of the comeback, the comeback series. I'll probably end this series soon. Uh, maybe not, actually. There's a lot of, there's a lot of coming back that still needs to be done, so I don't know. I don't know where I'm at right now, but okay. I, I forget things when I start recording. Let me show you guys what the scar post-surgery is looking like about two months out, about like a month and a half out. So right now it's just like pink. Uh, it's like a pink, cool looking scar-ish. I don't know how long it's gonna last to be honest. It might not last my whole life. It might go away in a year. I have no idea. I would love for it to actually stick around because it's like battle scar, it's cool. But I don't know man, it's, it's, it's healing up really good. But that's what it's looking like. And let me give you a better perspective about what my mobility actually looks like compared to what it used to be. I used to not even be able to do this. Like that would be hard. It, it would feel really uncomfortable. It'd be like a full-fledged, you know, stretch. That's as easy. Let me show you. It's hard to avoid the boring shit, but I need to show you guys. I feel like you guys want to see this. Look at this. Feels great. Feels great. It looks like, damn, Luke, that probably hurts. No. It feels great. It feels great. Look at that, man. Look at that. Mobility, baby. You, it's been a minute, it's been a minute. Before I get back, well, before I start my workouts, uh, I just can't stress enough how important, especially for me, but for all you guys as well, how important stretching and warming up 
really is. Especially for me, especially for me now, uh, if I'm gonna start lifting even the lightest amount of weights, gotta warm up to those light weights with even lighter weights or no weight at all. And that be stretching, you know, uh, blah, 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 all that stuff, the whole nine, man. So I'm gonna start getting into my lifts. I'm gonna show you my top sets, not my boring warm ups, because that just gets boring, man. So let's just jump right into it. I've been using these 50 pound bands, 50 pounds of resistance bands the last few days, and they're great. They actually have been perfect for doing back, pole work. It feels amazing. But now this is gonna be actually the first day I try out these. Wait, this is the 70 pound. This is the 50 I've been using. The yellow is the 70 pound resistance. This is gonna be the first time I'm using them on camera, so this is perfect. I'm gonna be using that. I'll be doing some light dumbbell presses, maybe working up to 25, maybe the 30s for the first time. Not doing full range of motions because I don't want to stretch my arm out too, too far, but we're still working on the muscles, working on the surrounding muscles, make sure that's getting rebuilt and rehabbed and all that stuff too. Because the surrounding muscles are just as important because, you know, it helps take a lot of stress off the pec tendon. So, got to make sure I'm doing all that and doing everything correctly, precisely, and intelligently. I'm actually gonna stick, since I'm doing back, triceps, and shoulders, um, I always, I, always, I don't know why I said I'm just gonna do shoulders. I lied, I know, I didn't, I'm not, I wasn't telling the truth, now I am, I'm coming out clean. I'm gonna do back, triceps, and shoulders. I always throw on biceps like every single workout, so let's give those a little rest. Um, I'm gonna do 20 pounds, just for the shoulder presses, max. Uh, there is no reason to rush the weight. It's light, it doesn't feel heavy. Uh, that's not the point. The point is, it's I'm just not ready yet. I'm not there yet, you know? There's no point in trying to rush and try to do 30, 35 pound thermo presses when this little guy over here still needs to recover. This is already ahead of my time and where I'm supposed to be. So, you know, better safe than sorry. It feels great. Let's keep it that way. So, that's what we're going to do. Probably going to do three, four sets of the whole circuit. You guys seen it. Uh, like I said, warming up. So important. And... One last thing, I know I'm talking a fuck ton, but IG, man, I'm posting a lot of stories, posts, videos on there. Make sure to follow, you know, Luke underscore Ellsman. Come on, go shoot me a follow. I'll be active there all the time. Got any questions, DM me, stuff like that. Show some love. Link in the description. All right, let's get back to the workout. All right, I will be performing a drop set. I up the weight by five pounds for my final set with the tricep extensions. Then go to failure with this. It's very comfortable, doesn't bother me at all. Then I'm gonna be dropping the 10 pounds off each side and go to failure again. A little, 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 I can't hold. Thumbnail, maybe? Yeah. Alright, doing extremely light front raises. I'm doing it, can't think, directly in front of me and out uh, about. It'll be like 45 degrees. Scratch that, I'm doing front raises with the dumbbells, extremely light, 
10 pounds while seated. I usually do it while standing, so this way I get to focus a little bit more on uh, the negative and squeezing a little bit and actually getting some uh, mind muscle connection in there. And I'm also supersetting it with weighted cable rows with the rope. The rope, I feel like it's a uh, very comfortable um, pull movement for me, as well as the bands. When I do the rope, it just feels a lot better than when I use like uh, an easy bar curl or a straight bar, something like along those lines, something like that. So I do that, I do, I do whatever's most comfortable. So super saiyan in those two, pump is brazy right now, boys, brazy. So I'm gonna cut the video and leave you guys off with the last two workouts I'm gonna be hitting. Uh, that being tricep, cable tricep extensions reverse with the fat grips. We get jacked that way. And with sit-ups, gotta get the core. I can't do leg lifts because I can't hang from the bar yet. And I can't do cable cable crunches because I can't support too much weight and I can do a lot. But I'm gonna leave off, I'm gonna leave the video off on that. I'm gonna say my goodbyes now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys want to see, man. Comment below. Comment below. Comment below. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. But otherwise, guys, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this content. Like I said, uh, I wanna keep keeping you guys updated on my whole comeback, all that progress. Cause it's a big deal, man. It's a big deal. Otherwise, guys, I'm gonna leave it off with the workout. Stay motivated, stay high, stay beautiful, stay sexy. I don't know where I'm going with this. Peace. I live inside my own world of make believe. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. I see the through ice cream.